So welcome back. Um, this is where the uh, fun begins. This is where it gets really kind of exciting. This is when we begin to shape, shape the gun stock and give it its life. This episode, we're going to work on the butt area. So I'm going to divide this into, into probably four distinct areas. One would be, the, the first would be the butt. The second would be the pistol grip area or pistol grip and flute area. The third would be the receiver area. And then finally, we'll come back and we'll finish up the shaping on the, the forearm, uh, which would include sort of blending all of this, this, this bottom section in as well. Let's get started. We've got it done. Uh, all the shaping is, has been been finished. It is still a little bit oversized-ish, not not much. Um, I always like to leave myself a little wiggle room, so that when I begin to shape the next section, that if I need to make any any contour blends, that I still have the material left to do that, um, because because it has to look like like I intended it. It has to look natural. So again, in this area, I've left a little extra material just, just so we can make those blends. 
What I'm going to do is I'm going to apply a little bit of mineral spirits to this and before I close out the episode I'll give you a, I'll give you a little bit of a, um, a close-up of it. And here's the nice thing about the mineral spirits. First off is it, it'll, darken, it'll darken the color like as though you put finish on it. But it does a couple things uh, as well by putting the um, Putting the mineral spirits on it, it helps raise the grain a little bit. I, I'm not down to final final sanding on this. Uh, this is sanded as far far down as 100 grit, uh, which is still fairly aggressive. Um, so I need to come back when this is all shaped. I need to come back uh, with 150 and, and probably 180. Uh, I may go as low as 220, but I don't think I need to. This this is this is brutally hard. This this material, um, so the grain is really tight. So I I probably won't need to go into 220 to, to get a nice finish because I think the finish is going to be there. But this is 100 grit. So by putting the mineral spirits on, what we end up getting is that we we first off get to see see the grain, and you'll see how beautiful this really is. The other thing that it does is it helps reveal the shadow lines. And by revealing the shadow lines, I can get a, a really uh, nice sense of, um, you know, how, how clean, clean my shapes and my lines are. It also reveals any deep gouges that, that I might have missed in the sanding. So the mineral spirits, it, it helps. It helps, um, helps us see, see um, things that we might otherwise not be able to see. All right, so I'm going to go do that. I'm going to put that mineral spirits on. I'm going to give you some close-ups, and I'll see you next time we come back, and we'll do that pistol group area. Thanks for watching.